taken a couple of days to get back into contender sailing and get used to the boat. There was a lot of rust to be shaken off, so uh, shook that off and now we're good to go. I don't think I'll ever ever not have a contender or be associated with the class of two. It's a great boat. I do sail the two boats, the A and the contender, sort of concurrently. It's just a great boat for close racing. You can leave it in the shed for six months, a year, two years, and pull it out again and be competitive. And it's a great group of guys, so yeah, we'll always be somewhere within the contender fleet. I start well near the boat and then I keep the, the right and I went uh, at the first mark uh, not to bed. I did a very well uh, second upwind uh, that, uh, <laughs> that put, pushed me up uh, in the first position uh, at the top mark and then uh, uh, the, the winds uh, dropped down and uh, all, the, all was uh, easy. The first race today was very, very similar to a place where, uh, where I live, in Lago di Garda. Probably here the, the winds is more shifty. Well, obviously the light winds don't suit me at all and um, pretty happy with today's race though you know it wasn't that windy it was you know kind of only 12 to 15 I still showed that you know I got pace in that kind of breeze strength so I'm just obviously wasn't my regatta too many races in light airs and you know I'm carrying too much weight for this for that so I've sailed here quite a few times before, so I've got a little bit of understanding on how the place works. It doesn't mean I know exactly what goes on, but at least I've seen all the pitfalls before. And I'm still falling into them, so <laughs> it's, uh, it's a tough place to sail, especially in those easterlies. Quite a few times I've had some close races with Simon, uh, a couple of close ones with Callum. Mark and uh, Maddie are uh, just that step ahead, so not having much luck with those two guys, but doing all right in B Division. <laughs> the simplicity, you know, just the fact that uh, I can just jump on it and in half an hour be out sailing without without too much stuffing around. You know, I sail uh, I-14s as well, and there's a it's quite involved with crews and, and all the all the stuff with the, the boat. So this is just a, an easier way to get out racing and enjoy myself. So quite quite like it.